Hi guys, so I'm gonna show you the cheetah hack method today. The cheetah hack method is basically highlighting and contouring with dots all over your face. Um, it looks kind of crazy, but the results are really awesome. So the first thing we're gonna do is use the um, Best Blend Forever brush. Some people use their fingers. I feel like it's a little gross to dip my finger into my makeup, so I like to use the small end of this brush and start with my contour. And you're just gonna tap it to pick up some contour, and then you're gonna tap it right on to your face, okay? And you can dot it, you can go as heavy or as light as you'd like. I go a little heavier on my contour, um, just because that's my personal preference. But you're just gonna highlight and contour the same way you normally would, and in the same spots, but you're using less product. So this is really great if you feel like the makeup is cakey or greasy, definitely reach out for help, but also you might just need to use a lighter hand and this is a great way, a great technique to help with that. Okay, same thing here. Just dotting right along my jawline. I'm gonna contour my nose really quick. It is not cute, but that's okay. it'll be cute in a minute. Okay, so I've contoured. Now I'm gonna use my all over base highlight color that's most like normal foundation. I'm gonna do the same thing where I tap it on and now I'm gonna dot. And I'm just pretty much putting this everywhere that I didn't contour. Real light right there. What I like about this method too is if you have acne spots like I do, you can dot right on top of them and you're gonna get better coverage right there. Super cute, right? Okay, if you're using a brightening highlight for extra coverage or concealing, you can go ahead and dot right under it your eye for that. I like a little right on my nose and right there. Okay, last but not least, a little bit of blush. I'm using Cindy today, and I'm just gonna pop it right on the apples of my cheek. A little bit goes a long way. And I'm gonna take the leftovers onto my lips. Okay, now we blend with the other end of the brush. So I like to start with the lighter parts of my face, so where I put my highlight color and just start kind of swirling. Doesn't have to be perfect. Like I said, we can go in and pretty much fix anything. Cream is really flexible. It doesn't set into your skin the same way that powder and liquid do. Okay, so you can already see the coverage coming together. Same thing down here. Right there. So now we're gonna blend out the contour a little bit more. You can just kinda of big swooping motion. A little bit right on my cheek for that blush. Okay. Now, here's where I maybe do things differently. I don't really know. I feel like it's all a matter of personal preference. I like to take the fluffy end that I've been blending with and pick up just a little bit of contour to help me blend all of this out because I just have, oh, I just struggle with blending it, okay? That's all. So we're just gonna blend, blend, blend. My hair is getting blended too, it's fine. Just like that. Because you don't want any harsh lines across your face. All right. So, highlighted and contoured. Now we get to do the fun step with the illuminator. I'm gonna take just a little bit and tap it right on the top of my cheekbone, my cupid's bow, maybe even a little right on my nose. Um, and we're done, that's it. One compact, one brush, the cheetah hack method, and it's given me the coverage I want. This is, hang on, that's a, not quite what I want. <laughs> pop that up okay so it gives really nice light coverage 
but still coverage. And it's gonna help your makeup to last a long time because you're not dipping a ton onto the brush and wasting it. So it's a really fun method to try. Try it out if you already have your makeup, see what you think. If you haven't ordered the makeup, this is just another way that you can highlight and contour to customize it to your preferences.